Hi, Derek here, your friendly Mackenzie friend. Today, I'm going to provide a quick overview of the financial order application process. What the key stages are from applying for the financial application right through to receiving your financial settlement. There are basically three stages and hearings in the financial order process, with each hearing requiring preparation of documents, reports and evidence prior to the hearing. The three hearings are the first directions appointment, which is known as the FDA, the financial dispute resolution, known as the FDR, and the final hearing. Now I'll be releasing new videos covering each of the hearings, so if you haven't done so already, please press the subscribe button below so that you are notified when they're available. Now, the first directions appointment is really for the call to understand what the financial assets and issues are between the two parties. The second hearing, the financial dispute resolution, is for the two parties to negotiate in an attempt to reach an agreement with the help of the judge. And if they can't reach an agreement, then the judge will order a final hearing. The final hearing is where the judge will decide what the financial outcome and settlement will be for each of the parties. Now, the financial proceedings are really a financial process which involves form filling, financial disclosures, making offers and negotiating with the other party. It's not about complex legal precedents and hours of legal research and as such, you really don't need to pay an expensive lawyer to run your case for you. And if you do, it will still be you that does most of the heavy lifting on their behalf and then you pay them a fortune for the privilege. What you actually need is a good understanding of the family court financial process, advice and guidance. And that is where my videos come in and help you. Prior to the first directions hearing, there is work to do and documents to exchange. The court will therefore set a date for the hearing 14 to 16 weeks after the application has been received. You will receive a notice of the hearing from the court and that notice will also set out what documents have to be submitted to the court and exchanged with the other party by what date. As mentioned, the Dispute Resolution Appointment, or DRA, is for the parties to negotiate and with the help of the judge, hopefully reach a financial settlement. Prior to the hearing, there are further documents that need preparing and exchanging, which may include financial offers to each party. It's also a very good idea to prepare a few other documents that will help you and the judge at the hearing by summarising both parties' respective position for the hearing. And I'll cover this in more detail in my DRA video, which I'll be making available very soon. The final hearing is exactly that. This is the last hearing and will end with the judge providing the verdict of the financial settlement, which is known as the final order. The hearing is normally a minimum of a day and can last several days for more complex financial cases. The hearing is a trial where both parties will be on the stand to give their evidence and be cross-examined by the judge and the other party. This can be for most a little stressful and a daunting experience. However, at the end of the hearing, the whole matter is finalised and you can now move on with your life. The whole process from start to finish should take about 10 to 12 months. It can take longer depending on the court's availability and the time required for certain reports to be made available. Well that's it for today and I'll be releasing the first directions appointment video very soon so please press the subscribe button below. 
If you'd like assistance or to talk about your financial case, then go to www.McKenzie Friend Consultants with an S dot co dot UK and book your free consultancy with me. Bye for now and until my next video.